as an Egyptian um, website, I should ask you about uh, the, the, the time when um, Mohamed Salah was in, uh, in Rome and, and Fiorentina. You were there, you played against him? Yeah, I played against him, yeah. How was that? He was not my direct opponent because when we played against the when we played against uh, uh, Mohamed Salah, I think I should maybe even thank him for that because we changed system. Really? Yeah, yeah. We played uh, because before we were playing with four in the back. We were playing a four-three-three, and uh, to counter him, we played three-five-two because he likes to come inside. So when he would come inside, our central defender would step up and be tight and close to him. So from that point on, I would I would play uh, as a left wing back through the whole line with nobody in front of me. And that was perfect for me. Because those, those two games uh, helped me uh, establish myself uh, in the team and with the fans because I played two, two very good games. So yeah. That was good. A good experience playing against him. <laughs> <laughs> he was good already. Very good. I think the thing that he developed when, the, yeah, the year after, I think, when he got to Liverpool was his finishing. That's the only thing that was missing. And how was the atmosphere of the Roma Derby in general? It's, uh, it's electric. It's, uh, it's, uh, you, you, as a, as a footballer, you live for those type of games. The, 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 the the, the the passion, the, the, the tension, the, the pressure of the of the of the fans, and uh, the uh, the when you play the when you play at home, even though it's the same stadium, and when you play away, it's, it's it's not the same at all. It's not the same at all because when you play when you play away, it's very hostile. You feel like everybody is against you, but when um, when it's home, you feel that the 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 the, the, the push and uh, the, the support of your fans so it's very different and the thing is also what, what I kind of like about it the players don't like each other so that brings the extra the extra spice let's yeah. say so I, I love every bit of it well that's uh, that's unique yeah it's uh, it's it's very unique well finally what's your expectations for Belgium and Qatar 2022 make a bit this year i really don't i really don't know because uh, i think the, the the i think the most complete team let us say i think it's no secret 